Jason from My Geek Easy at Motor City Comic Con with Jack O'Halloran. Jack, how are you doing? I'm doing the best I can, whatever they let me get away with. <laughs> That's amazing. So, Jack was in Superman 2. What was it like to play that towering, iconic character who doesn't say a thing, but says so much? I loved it. I mean, I, uh, when they asked me to do the role, Jackie Gleason was a good friend of mine. He did a picture full of Gigo, which won an Oscar, playing a deaf, dumb mute. So I said, if I ever got an opportunity to play a character with facial and body language, I would embrace it. And Superman Non was a perfect character because you had Zod was a vicious general, Sarah was a man-eater, somebody had to relate to the children because it was a children audience. So I took this big brutish guy and played him like a child. Yeah. And it seemed to work pretty well. So what is everyone that we've talked to has talked about some sort of iconic experience or scene that really stands out in their mind. What would that be for you? Wow. <laughs> you know, I really like the scene where I, I was burning a hole for the first time in the side yeah. of the truck. And, and the little kid beside me, and I, and I jubilantly jumped up and down like a little kid. That oh my God, look what I can do, you know? Yes. Uh, that was a great scene. Awesome, awesome. And then of course, I've been asking everyone, what was it like to work with the icon Christopher Reeves? Christopher was an icon at that time. You know? Yeah. He was. Uh, he had never done anything before, other than a soap opera. And, and when he came on the set, originally he was like 170 pounds, soaking wet. And when David Prowse was going to work him out, I told him, I said, you don't want to bulk this kid up. You want to cut him like, yeah. like Steve Reeves was when he was Mr. Universe. You want to put on weight and put definition in him because he won't, his ego wouldn't wear something underneath the costume to make him look, you know. So he, he built him up exactly correctly for 20, for 20 some pounds on him. And then Richard Donner got a performance out of him that, he should have sent Donna Christmas presents for the rest of his life because he'd never done anything before Superman. Mm -hmm. And Richard Donner, Chris had that look and the way Donner had him relaxed, no one will ever be Superman and Clark Kent like Christopher. I think you're exactly right. I mean, he just... just he did the transition so well. And that's all Richard Donner. Richard Donner brought that performance out of him. That's fantastic. And now that is who, I mean, I can't imagine anyone else as Superman, even though several people have played it since. Never it's, been the same. No, it no. just was it. Never, never been the same. Awesome, awesome. Well, thank you so much for your time. We really appreciate it. And you have a good rest of the con. Thank you. Thanks. Take care.